Let's just keep running, keep running. an interesting item hello mister hope you don't mind but you do mind I'm assuming falling is death but I'm not gonna let's risk it let's figure find out falling is death Right, let's not fall then. So that's a thing that exists. Am I meant to go down there? Because I don't want to. But if I must, I must, I guess. I... I heavily recommend you experiment and try to make a level that uses square textures and smaller rooms. And just vanilla monsters, just a vanilla level, a vanilla small reasonable level. Just so that you can gain more experience on them. Come out, ass. That's... Anything else will I have? The thing. The radiation suit. What? What? Alright, well, I was in, now I'm out. What do I do now? Are these things something? Do these not open? Ah, right, I forgot I had the little rocket launcher. Um, I mean, there is no... Well, there kind of is a rule that says doors must open, but... Also, why is this one different than the others? Maybe it's just better aligned with the grid and as such looks thicker than the others. Oof, right. All right. Okay, just three things. Not opposed to that. cells and don't have a single cell weapon. Alright, put them out. One more thing you might be interested in adding is a, a faster way for the player to return to, to the starting area because not much happens between here and there. If you've killed everything then there's no real reason to stay here. Either that, or you might be... And there's still someone somewhere shooting at me. Either that, or you might want to add an enemy that just appears once you've already collected the key. 
Monster closets. Yeah, you might want to add monster closets. Oh, um, my enemies. 133. And I got the yellow key. Right. Oh, that's a thing. That's a thing. Is the floor moving as well? Oh, this is horrible. That is worse. Corpses. Unclear whether they died on their own. Uh, is this lagging? It's even hard to tell. What the hell is hitting me? Are there any hit scanners? Uh, there was a chain gunner. Is there any other hit scanners I should know about? This is. I'm not gonna lie. This is this area here is kind of horrible. Moving parts can be interesting, but maybe not have that many. Ah, that guy exists. Alright. What the hell is this? Well, there's something at the top. Am I gonna have to start jumping? The fuck is this? Okay. I think... I recognize this. Uh, what you gonna do, I guess? I remember those guys. Yep, that's definitely laggy. I'm gonna waste my ammunition in that guy. No! Oh. And this doesn't hurt. I really didn't want to see. And I'm at 6% health. <sighs> Alright. I'm running low in time. This must have already been a four-parter. So... Fuck off. I'm gonna go up to this point, maybe I'll continue later, might not record that, but... I've had fun so far, too long, it's a bit too ambitious, you might wanna have your... Here's a, a, a general rule, everything you make is always gonna be better than whatever came before it. So your, whatever level you make next is gonna be better than this. Um, whatever comes after that is gonna be better than that one. So. Yeah, you might want to keep the first things you make rather short so that you can just pack in as much learning as possible and get to the point where you make actually really good things. Not to say that this is bad, it's just not not really the best thing ever. There are a bunch of things here that need toggling, changing, tweaking just a bit here and there. It's very ambitious, and it's always a good thing. Ambition is always a good thing. Um. Right, what could you 
definitely I heavily recommend trying to practice a bit with squarish environments. Sticking to squares is also a bad thing, but giving squares a bit of a... Well, it's important that you know squares before you can leave them behind. Um, your rooms are a bit too big even, and your enemy placement, though interesting and somewhat balanced, I find it interesting that the enemy placement tends to be balanced. There's still a bit... not enough... There's somehow not enough enemies for this much space. Even though there's so many enemies and so many things happening, it still has a bit of a barren feeling. The difficulty's fine, the difficulty's just right. Balancing is fine. Um... It's a cool level, it's, a, it's an interesting level. Mm. But you really need to practice with s smaller things, like more tight things. Square things, you definitely need to practice with square things. Right. Uh, this has been... Four Flavored Ice Cream by Hamlet Hamter.